Hey everybody, Will Hamilton here, and I'm going to be talking about the Roger Federer, Leighton Hewitt, fourth round match at the Australian Open. <laughs> Federer and Hewitt have a lot of history together. They've played a bunch of times, but unfortunately for Hewitt, Federer has won the last 14 meetings. He's basically, not basically, he has just owned him. And the last time Hewitt has won a match, has beaten Federer, was in 2003, so seven years ago. It's Again, it's unbelievably lopsided. And the reason is that Hewitt is a counterpuncher. He doesn't have a big weapon, a big go-to shot. Rather, he works the ball around the court, makes you hit a lot of balls, and he tries to break down your strokes and force you into errors or force you into short balls, which he can attack. Well, the problem for Hewitt is that those type of players don't give Federer any problems. If you're going to beat Fed in a major, you need to have a big shot, a forcing shot, something that pressures Federer into mistakes, into short balls. At the U.S. Open last year, you had Del Potro, huge ground strokes off both wings, obviously a huge serve. Rafael Nadal has got that lefty topspin that he hooks cross-court high to Federer's one-handed backhand, and Federer really struggles with that shot. And if this tournament is any guide, the only person Federer struggled with was Igor Andreev in the first round, who's got a massive forehand. And Andreev was on point with that shot for three sets, and that's why the match was so close. You look at the other guys Federer has played, somebody like Albert Montagnes, who is very similar to Hewitt. They're both counterpunchers. Federer killed him. So I don't see Hewitt winning this match. I think it'll go four sets, and I think Hewitt wins the first set, if he's going to win a set, it'll be the first set. And that's because he'll be pumped up, he'll be amped up, and so will the crowd. The crowd's going to give him a little bit of a boost. Now, like we've been doing with other matches, we're going to be giving away some free stuff for this match. Whoever can best predict the score of the match is going to win a $25 gift card, courtesy of TennisExpress.com. So what you got to do is please rate this video and subscribe to our channel, and then post your prediction in the comments below. You have up until when this match starts, to make your prediction, so good luck. Want to know the secret to Roger Federer's forehand? Click the link in the description and sign up for our 100% free course.